Here's a pitch from Ashbaugh. Swing and a miss on a high fastball and up in Corey's eyes. And again, hitters just cannot resist swinging at high fastballs out of the strike zone. If it's up in the ball into the outfield to get a run scored. Washu is a 2-0 lead looking for more. The base is loaded and one out. Gardner, a line drive in the left field for a base hit. Mentz will score. Nagel's held at third base. Brandeis could tie the game. Tim Tega says, I want to get out of the inning with a full count. Let's see if he can get a strikeout. Here's the pitch. He does get a strikeout to end the inning, so Brandeis does not score. And Tim Tegg with a big strikeout to end the inning. Position at release point. He's obviously found a way to do it. He's been pretty solid so far this year. Well, Jared is called upon to make sure that Brandeis does not go any further than this leadoff walk. Shaw bunts the ball hard to third. Cajal throws a second for it. Now it could be a double play, and it is. Washu, well that's a great tonic there. Have to kind of hope that at least we get one run scored here. Lamontia first pitch swinging, a flare in the left center field. It's going to fall for a base hit. One run is in. A throw to the plate is wild. Two runs will score. Here comes a third. Nobody's covering home, and Washu scores three times on that play, and Washu has tied the game. That's what we have here, though. Let's see if Troy can deliver. 2-2 count with one out. Bottom of the ninth. Here's the pitch. Line drive into right field. It's going to get down, and it's going to be a get-down victory for Wash U. Bauer rings a shot into the right field corner, and that's going to win the game, and Wash U has